Before beginning a discussion of oxidation and reduction in living systems, we must understand how to recognize oxidation or loss of electrons and reduction, the gain of electrons in organic compounds. It's easy to determine when an oxidation or reduction occurs in inorganic compounds because the process is accompanied by a change in charge. When electrons are lost, cations are formed. When electrons are gained, anions are formed. When organic compounds are involved, however, there may be no change in charge and it is often difficult to determine whether oxidation or reduction has occurred. The following simplified view might help. In organic systems, oxidation may be recognized as a gain of oxygen or the loss of hydrogen. A reduction reaction may involve the loss of oxygen or the gain of hydrogen. Consider the following compounds shown at the bottom. A primary or secondary alcohol may be oxidized to an aldehyde or a ketone respectively by the loss of hydrogen. An aldehyde may be oxidized further to a carboxylic acid by gaining oxygen. So if we just look at the oxidation process, so what's going on as we go from left to right, you can see we go from our primary alcohol that's shown here, and what happens when we oxidize a primary alcohol? We produce an aldehyde. By the loss of two hydrogen atoms and the formation of a double bond, between the carbon and the oxygen. An aldehyde can be further oxidized by the gain of oxygen, and you see that oxygen, which converted the aldehyde into a carboxylic acid. Oxidation and reduction reactions also play an important role in the chemistry of living systems. In living systems, these reactions are catalyzed by the actions of various enzymes called oxidoreductases. These enzymes require compounds called coenzymes to accept or donate hydrogen in the reactions they catalyzed. Nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide, or NAD+, is a coenzyme commonly involved in biological oxidation reduction reactions. We see NAD+, in action in the final reaction of the citric acid cycle, an energy harvesting pathway essential to life. In this reaction, catalyzed by the enzyme malate dehydrogenase, malate is oxidized to produce oxaloacetate. And you can see how malate is oxidized by the loss of these two hydrogens and the formation of the double bond between the carbon and this oxygen. And you can also see how NAD plus is reduced by the addition of hydrogen to form NADH.